We cannot stress enough the danger this hurricane poses. This is going to be a big and powerful storm. Our nation has been tested by the destructive force of Mother Nature. Storms are changing for sure, and the footprint, that is the, the fingerprints of humans are on that change. We know that the CO2 increasing in the atmosphere isn't from volcanoes. It's not natural. We can see the signature of fossil fuels in that carbon dioxide. Right around 1999, Hurricane Floyd, or Tropical Storm Floyd, it wasn't a hurricane, Tropical Storm Floyd came in and that's where all these real crazy storms had started um, with, with like massive, really massive flooding. I was a volunteer firefighter in town for 25 years. The town formed a boat rescue team because there was no, um, there was no uh, water rescues back in 99. The way we get a cloud is to evaporate water somewhere. That evaporating water then rises up into the atmosphere and it goes up to some level and then it gets, it decreases, the temperature decreases, then it condenses into a cloud. What's happening now is the water vapor is more abundant because it's warmer, but particularly as we get a more a, convection in the atmosphere, bringing it up to a higher altitude, these storms just get bigger and bigger. So what's changed is really wind speed and the amount of water in the atmosphere. And those things have created these really large and destructive storms. We've gotten a lot more intense storms. The frequency is maybe debatable, but the frequency of the really intense storms has gone up a lot. And the damage associated with them, the costs of that have also gone up a lot. We view this as a humanitarian crisis because um, these storms are devastating, they're more chronic, um, they're gonna require more from us as an organization. But I think we're prepared that we're going, we're preparing that we're going to have to do more of it than we might have done historically just because of the frequency and intensity of some of these disasters. So now we're seeing storms that used to be, or just, you know, just a heavy rain that was once in a hundred year event is now maybe once in a 10 year. And in some cases we're seeing these once in a hundred years back to back in the same season. And that's new. We didn't used to do that. I remember as a kid going down there, having friends down there, and uh, going to birthday parties, and basically everybody in Lost Valley had a, had a fixed up basement. I mean, you just better have your furnace and hot water heater down there and like nothing else, because uh, it's, it's gonna get ruined. It's just inevitable that it's gonna get ruined. What we're seeing now is sort of the proof in the pudding, as they say. The CO2 is increasing, the atmosphere is warming, and we're seeing the consequences. <laughs>